Well, hey, good morning, everybody. It's Monday morning. Hope you had a great weekend. We had a great weekend here at the building. We had a bunch of people, so that was great. Um, we are on Nugget of Truth number 206. This is a good one. There is a real danger in being good. It doesn't draw us any closer to God. In fact, it draws us away from the living gospel. External obedience will leave us joyless, frustrated when we do fail, and transactionally focused. All right, let's take that line by line. There is a real danger in being good. Well, most of us wake up in the morning as believers and we want to be good, but why do you want to be good? Is it to earn or keep God's favor? And then we focus on our goodness when we're successful. It's easy for us to go, look what I'm doing. It doesn't draw us any closer to God. When do we draw closest to God is when we need him. When do we need him? We need him the most when we're, when we're wrestling with something. In fact, it draws us away from the living gospel. The living gospel is your daily recognition that you need God. External obedience will leave you joyless. Church, the church, the American church is full of joyless people. It leaves us joyless, it leaves us frustrated when we fail, and it leaves us transactionally focused. If we're focusing in on our behavior as a way to please God, we're in a transactional understanding. I'm good, so he does this. I'm good, so he does this. Instead of, he did that, so I'm going to be good. He gave his life. He gave himself as a sacrifice. He imputed righteousness into me. I keep going back to that. Old King James word, impute. He did this, so because of that, I'm going to live my life accordingly. We get it backwards. We live with a transactional understanding. So it's a fascinating, no fascinating, it's an interesting idea. There's a real danger of being good, especially when you're successful at it. Uh, it doesn't draw you any closer to God. God wants relationship, and relationship requires dependence. And if we're being good for the wrong reason, we're not in a relationship. We're in agreement. We're in a contract with somebody. Um, yeah, and it can leave us joyless and frustrated and with a transactional understanding of the gospel. So, all right, kind of a strange thought, isn't it? There's a danger of being good, especially when you're good at it, because does that draw you any closer to God? What does God want? He wants your heart. You want your heart more than your obedience. So, all right. Take care. God bless. Have a great day. Bye-bye. Have a great week. Oh, tomorrow at 10 o'clock, we're doing our house of prayer at 10 a.m. to 11 if you're available during the day. And then Wednesday night from 7 to 8. So uh, check social media and, oh, I'll include some stuff with this post. All right. Take care. God bless. Bye.